God, tonight as our heart be open unto you, that you will pour your understanding, your knowledge, that we will be rich in you because it's not in the nature, it's in the spirit. Mm -hmm. And Father, yes, God, let that it be your soul. Thank you. Thank you. Let, yes, God, that the flesh will die and we'll come more alive in the spirit. Mm -hmm. Because, yes, you said you come to get life and life more abundantly. And Lord, only way we can receive the abundant life, we have to receive it through the Spirit. Amen. And Father, tonight as we begin to open up our hearts and our minds, and oh God, give us the understanding Amen. that we can behold the wonders of your law, because your law is wonderful, your way is true, and your way is the way to bring us to our rightful place in you. Amen. And we thank you for our place tonight Amen. as we begin to open up and let you bring the purification of your blood through us. Yes. Purify through the word tonight. And Lord, we thank you for divine healing for those that are sick. We ask you, Lord, to look down on the grieved families tonight. Amen. And Lord, I thank you yet for the divine healing for my sister, Lord yes, God. Amen. And Lord, I thank you for the safe trip for Benita tonight, Lord Amen. God. Your head is around and we Amen. in agreement, Lord Amen. God, that no weapon formed against us shall prosper. And God, she shall go in safe and come back safe. Amen. And we just thank you for her safety tonight. Amen. Yes, God, you are the King of Kings. You are the Lord of glory. You are El Shaddai. You are Jehovah, you are the El of my seat, you are the God of our love and the oh God, we thank you, yes, you are, you are who you say you are, and we believe by faith that is already done, and now, Lord God, we lease it all up to you, that you have your way tonight, in Jesus' name. Amen, 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 amen. I just thank God for Amen. God is just good all by itself. Sometimes we don't understand what's going on, how it's going on, but he's still good, ain't he? Amen. 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 Hallelujah. I don't know what kind of mood he got me in, but I know I'm in one. Amen. amen. But I don't want to come out of my own flesh. I want to come out in the spirit. Amen. amen. A part of me have to die, so Lord God, thank you. Amen. Thank you, I'm on the Father's wheel. Amen. Amen. He's doing some things within my mind, my heart, and my soul. And I thank God for my deliverance. Amen. 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 You know, sometimes you have to lead us pray and they bring the word. Also, they have to face some things too. Amen. Amen. And I thank God that God is dealing with me, cleaning me, purifying me. Also, as well, He dealing with you. Amen. 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 Because, thank amen, you. I don't exempt like nobody else. Amen. amen. And I thank God for that tonight that I know within myself I need some things done amen. for me. Amen. 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 So I can be fit for the kingdom of God. So when He cracked the sky on him and said, don't you can't come up. I want to say, come on, Sarah. Amen. 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 I want to say, come on up here. Amen. Amen. I don't want to be like on anything. Amen. 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 And tonight, Amen. The Lord gave me the third chapter of John. Go well, the third. Amen. And and I looked at that. You know, we always uh, quote that scripture about that. Amen. And but tonight. I'm going to show you something. We think the prosperity is in natural things, but it's not the natural thing that we need to prosper in. Amen. We need to prosper more with the truth of the word of God. Amen. Amen. The truth. Amen. And the truth is Jesus. Amen. And we need that Jesus need to increase in us more than what he's increasing in us. And and I got the thing, he woke me up with that scripture, so I said, okay, Lord, I begin to look at it. So I said, tonight, I'm going to bring it to the church. Amen. Amen. 
so you can prosper spiritually, then the natural already come anyway. Amen. Then you know where your measure of where you at with God when you allow the Spirit of God live inside of you and you'll be able to move according to His purpose, His will. Then Jesus will be fully in control of your life. And He's not in fully control because if He was, some area of our life, we would be so disturbed. Amen. Come on. Amen. I, I'm learning, that, and I'm saying that even with myself, some area of my life, he's not in fully control. control. So he want to be fully controlled in our life. The only way he can be fully controlled is that we got to walk in truth. Amen. The truth will be true to die. Self. Amen. Amen. So I'm true to die. So I thank God tonight, I'm going to show y'all, amen, how he wants us to walk, amen, in him, amen. So we're going to turn to 3 John, and we're going to uh, start at verse 2 and 3. And I'm going to show you, I got my pencil, y'all. 3 John, start at the first verse. I'm going to say second verse. Beloved. First thing he called us what? Beloved. Beloved. I wish above all things. All things. Look at the word thing. He above all things. That thou mayest prosper and be in health, even as thy soul prospereth. And the topic is thy soul. Your soul needs to prosper. Amen. Amen. Your soul needs to prosper. Only way your soul can prosper is through the truth, through Jesus Christ. Amen. Thy soul. I learned if my soul prosper, then I'm not so much in the natural man. I'm more in my spiritual man. So the spiritual man within me needs to increase more than the natural man. Amen. 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 And I'm learning that if I let the natural man take more control Amen. I would be so disgusted. Amen. Amen. So, and I learned too, if I allow my natural man to keep uh, controlling me, then I'm not in good health. Yep. See, right there, tell you right there, beloved, I wish above all things that you may profit and be in. Amen. So my health come from. I can't live a good life until my soul prosper. Amen. And when I get my soul in the air, my health gonna get better. Amen. I won't have high blood pressure. Amen. All these diseases cannot take over my body because Jesus is pure. Amen. 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 And tell them they're rather and be in hell even as thy soul prosper. The more my soul prosper, the more healthy I'll be. Amen. Healthy in my body, healthy in my lifestyle, healthy in my finances. Something I'm not healthy in. Amen. 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 You gonna make it sense? Amen. Amen. Come on, let's get. I want you going down the way he said. For I rejoiced greatly when the brethren came and testified of the truth that is in thee, mm. even mm. as thou walkest. In the truth. Now you see, now he was telling them, hallelujah, I rejoice greatly when the brother came and testified of the, the truth. He was talking about you got to have truth. truth. See, he was glad to know they walking in truth. See, you got to know what you're walking in. Some folks walk in deception. Yep. They walk in lying. Then you ask, are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. But your action, your body language tell you, you ain't all right. So I'm not walking in what? Truth. So my body will function with truth. Amen. That's why we can't be here because we're not walking in truth. My God, I, I like that. When I say, okay, even as I walk in the truth, if I'm walking the truth, then I'm getting help. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. The more I walk in the truth about me, I'm going to get healthy. Amen. My relationship going to get healthy. Amen. My children going to get healthy. Amen. My household going to get in order. If I stay in the truth. truth. Look at verse 4. I have no greater joy than to hear that my children walk in truth. So he said, I'm so glad to hear that you are walking 
in truth. Because I'm, I'm saying this, today I hear more people who talk to me, or come talking to me, or me praying for them, they pray more about something negative going on in their life, but it's nothing really rejoicing that they have been blessed. Mm -hmm. It's not making sense. Mm -hmm. Most people talk more negative stuff because they're not walking in the truth. So if you are not walking in the truth, then you are walking in what? Defeat. Because your soul has to prosper. So my soul is not prospering. I'm... I, I'm walking in more depth than I am true. So he was saying, I'm glad I have I have no greater joy than to hear that my children walking in the truth. So that means they have changed what? Their way of thinking, their way of lifestyle. They have begun to what? Prosper. They so begin to prop that me God has fully begin to take in their life. For so I walk by faith and not by sight. Amen. Is that making sense? Mm -hmm. So truth got to grow in you. That with truth is Jesus. Amen. Amen. Okay, then look over that. Go turn your page over to 2 John 2 and 4. 2 and 4. Let's flip over, flip to John, 2 John 2 and 4. First John meant the second John and verse 4. You got it? Get my second John is it's gone. It's gone. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> is gone. Okay. Somebody got it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Read. Read second John. Second uh, John verse 4. Verse 4. I rejoice greatly that I found of my children walking in truth. So he said, I found great, found joy. I rejoice greatly that I found of my children walking in the True. truth. Amen. He was seeing them increasing. Amen. He saw that soul rejoicing. They, they came in a place that they were, what said, lifted up. Amen. 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 And see, when I see you walking in truth and I see you lifted up, I, I that that made my soul rejoice because you are moving according to what the word said. That means you're believing the word, trusting the word, and you're acting on the word. Amen. And see, he was rejoicing greatly because they were walking in the truth. And Luke made they walking in the truth. And what? As we have received a commandment from the Father. So they received the commandment from the Father. So if you receiving it, that means it's going to begin to prosper in you. Amen. The true prosper. Yes, amen. That means when you receive the truth, Jesus began to, uh, how to say, develop himself in you. Mm, amen. Is that making sense? Mm -hmm. See, the development of the truth begin to come more affected in your life that you know the truth and you know a liar when a liar Amen. open their mouth. Amen. Yeah, you sure do. Come on, y'all. If you walking in the truth, you will know them. He said you know them by their fruit. That's right. And you Jesus' know. fruit is the truth. Amen. Amen. He said, I rejoice greatly that I found um, thy, thy children walking in truth. And we have received a command. That's a commandment. Yes. Mm -hmm. command. From the Father. Mm -hmm. Walk in truth. truth. He said, Lie, you ain't gonna even tarry in this kingdom. So we got the lie the truth of Jesus Christ, what? To develop in us more than what he's been developed. Amen. 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 Ooh, I don't know if I can see. Yes, <coughs> I'm going to kill you on and I'm going to show you. Now we're going to go to St. John. You got that left? 14. Okay, let's go. I'm going to show you. I, I just thank God. See, it's very important 
to know that the truth is the Spirit of God. Amen. Uh, John, 14 chapter John, not 14 chapter John. I don't know, I'm back, I want to back over the end to the book. John 14, St. John 14, verse 16 through 17. I'm going to show you. I, you know, many times we quote that scripture, oh, that beloved, I wish above your health and prosper, but it ain't talking about stuff. He talking about prosper him. In your soul, thy soul prop. That's why sometimes we feel sad. Amen. Cause the soul grieve because it don't have the full and what? Developed. Developed of what it need to have the truth but the in power. Okay, look what uh, verse 16 said. And I will pray the Father. And he shall give you another comforter, that he may abide with you forever. So, the, uh, the comforter is the truth. Amen. That it may abide with you. Amen. If you're walking in truth, you're walking in the spirit. Amen. He abides. I'm giving you another comfort, that it may abide with you forever. Amen. Now let's see what this, this comfort is. Look what he said in verse 17. Even the spirit of truth. Even the spirit of truth. Even the spirit of truth. All right. Whom the world cannot receive. Whom the world cannot what? Receive. The world can't receive the truth because they are walking not in the the world system is based on more negative so they can't receive the truth. So if they can't receive the truth, then they can't receive you because you are of the truth. So you should have a, what's saying? I'm going to put, you shouldn't feel lost or being discouraged because they can't receive you because you are the truth. Don't, don't just come call somebody like they don't see it. If they don't have the truth in them, they can't receive the truth. Amen. Gosh. Amen. Look what he said. Because, because it seeth him not. They don't see it. How we get mad with folks? They don't speak. Mm -hmm. They can't speak. They don't see it. Amen. They don't True. see that. Only way they see it because you're walking the truth and you show the truth. I thought about the day I, I was at a, a save a lot and this elder man was uh, getting water and he dropped one of the things. The, the cop went over to hit somebody else's car so when he went in, I went out and helped him and I began then this little lady, she was looking at me. She was looking at me. I just got out there and went to help and he talking and she said, thank you. I, I, I sure appreciate it. And then not, and it wasn't, she saw something different. I said, we need to help one another because who we are. Amen. Yeah. And I was saying this, it ain't about the color, race, or creed, whoever. If you see somebody in there, if you got the truth, then you ain't looking at all that other right. stuff. Amen. Because I don't think like the world. I think like Jesus. Amen. 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 And see, that's what I'm saying. You walking in truth, you don't think like the world thinks. Amen. Amen. All right, let's see what they say. Neither know it him. They don't know it. If they don't know him, they don't know you. <laughs> All right, come on. But ye know him. You know him. You know it. <laughs> Ain't it strange we know it? But we don't. Don't let him increase Amen. in him, Amen. in us like we should. Amen. So that means I need to die more so I can learn more about him. Amen. How much he has increased in me. 
You don't know how powerful you are till you allow somebody to have a way with you. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. I want him to have what? His way. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I'm telling you, summed up. When you get to work, mm -hmm. you don't understand. You just say yes, yes, yes. yes. <laughs> That's all you would do is say yes mm -hmm. till he get ready to let you know. Mm -hmm. He said, but ye know him, for he dwelleth with you. And shall be in you. So he dwells with you and he's where? In you. So he's in you. He ain't outside of you. So only way he can increase in you to know him more, you got to face the truth. <laughs> About yourself. That the die of the natural man can die so he can come more alive and he can be seen. Then you know him more. I was talking to Byron, and Byron told me, he said, you just like you married to Jesus. When I talked, so he saw that how I was so about Jesus. He saw more of Jesus than he did me. Amen. So he saw more truth. Amen. That's what I'm trying to say. We, it's not religion, it's not tradition, it's a relationship. When you have a relationship with him, then he let you know stuff that other folks don't even know. See, that's what you want. You want relationship. You don't want no tradition. You don't want religion. You ain't under the law. You under grace. And so grace is walking in the truth. Amen. I'm going to make it seem right here. It gave my understanding a whole lot. Just flip over to John 15, verse 26. But when the comforter is come, when the comforter is come, whom I will send unto you from the Father, mm -hmm. even the Spirit of truth. So he's fighting to what it is. Even the Spirit of truth is the Spirit of Jesus Christ coming back in the earth realm in his spiritual form. He came in the spirit of, came in the flesh first. Now he come back in the spirit of his, who he really is. Amen. He's a spirit. You must worship him in spirit Amen. and in truth. You don't know him too, but through the spirit. Mm -hmm. they, they knew him through the flesh. Yeah. But once he died and went back, he came back again in the nature of his own self, which is a spirit. He can dwell within so he can do the work. Amen. So y'all are nothing but Jesus. Amen. The example of Jesus, but we don't see us sitting Amen. like that because of the negativity of the flesh of the world saying he ain't real. But he is real because you know him because he's within. Amen. You don't think like you used to think. It's because now he done come alive. And all of us have the breath of God inside us. Amen. All they did, we don't believe that we had it. Because we don't allow him to what? Activate Amen. himself to who he really is in you. Amen. You have power to speak life or Amen. death. That's right. You have that. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. But I got to get out of this. Yes. Oh my God, this right here, so it's dangerous. We pretty up, we smell it up, we do it out and it's still dead. <laughs> so he need Oh my God, thank you. But when the comfort is come, whom I will send unto you from the Father, even the Spirit of truth, which what? Which what? <laughs> Where did you have let? <laughs> Which proceeded? Which proceeded from the Father? He shall testify of me. <laughs> I mean, it's just awesome. I know. Oh, no. <laughs> I, you can't go to heaven no longer. <laughs> that was the Lord and she, she just stayed. You y'all see what I'm trying to see? God is dealing with me so with stuff to get people to know him. To know who he really is that perceive, we perceive from the Father. He shall testify of me. The Father testify of Jesus, the Spirit, the Father, and Jesus is one. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. It perceive. It perceived from the Father. The Father sent back. So y'all is all so, ooh, my shot, God, y'all. 
That means I'm trying to, my soul trying to act like Lena, and that ain't me. Amen. So I'm going to die, and Lena going to still be kicking. That's mm -hmm. right. Really, look at that. If y'all really look at life, mm -hmm. I'm thinking about my grandson, Jamie. He be getting out Monday. And he called me. He not got so big, he need clothes. So, come on, you got some money, you're going to tell me I'm getting some clothes. Now, let me tell you what he said. My homeboy, now you know what I told you. I say, now nah, you going right back <laughs> where you should have changed your mind. Leave them homeboys alone. Amen. See, you, I'm trying to say it. When you want the truth in you, you can't increase in the natural form of a human being. Amen. They were called death to you. Mm -hmm. You already dead within your own self. Now, <laughs> let, let, I tell the truth. Mm -hmm. And then you start hanging with somebody else and dead. Mm -hmm. Ain't that two funerals? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dead, yeah. dead, come yeah. on. Right. Yeah. 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 See, yeah. I, 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 yeah. That's where I, I, I think people uh, don't understand me thinking I'm trying to, but I'm seeing God is actually showing me what is causing us not to prosper, Lena, to get where we should go because you keep hanging with two dead people and you dead and they dead. Ain't no growth there. Amen. Think about it. And you want to, why in the world my stuff's gone so quick? And you, the Lord said, don't you go out there and your daughter, come on, brother, go out with me. He, you know, ask him for $50,000. I don't want to go out got no money. Then you go out with the $50, what you got? And then they both, you ain't got no money, she ain't needed. <laughs> so what is that, two dead together? That's right. Think about it. How we, but he said, I come to give you life. life. So I got the, my soul came proper with two dead people mm -hmm. inside. Mm -hmm. What well, I'm trying to say. Mm -hmm. Amen. Anybody Amen. got something to say? Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay. I thank God for the word. And now I said this thing. I said, oh, God. Ooh, he dealing with me by stuff. I'm bringing it. Hit me. I'm bringing it to y'all. Hey, he whooped me first. He whooped me, and I come and whoop it to y'all. The spirit, but the spirit of truth is God. He will guide you into all truth. And when you, when He guides you into all truth, face the truth. Amen. We got to face it. It's hard to face something when you know it's true, but it's true. It's amazing. We said, Lord, show me. Amen. Show me. Show me. Show me. Show me. We are able to show us, show us the truth. Uh -huh. And you, and when you, he show you the truth, look like you look over it. Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. And don't believe it. And don't believe it. Yeah. That ain't real. <laughs> they ain't like that. No, I ain't like that. When I was walking, he said, "Don't waver in the, don't waver in the truth." That what he said today to me. Don't waver in the truth. Trust me. He told me to trust it, and I kept saying, and I went and got my Bible. I'm looking at the word waver. You know, <laughs> I'm honey. And when I got all that Jane one, it was just telling you, you can't waver. It. It's just like a wind. You're tossed. And think of that time we are tossed. We're not the truth being selling. So I said, okay, Lord, thank you. Help my unbelief. You know what I said? Help my unbelief. Whatever it is that I need to keep my faith in, I got. I don't know what it is, but it hit me. I said, okay, Lord, help me. To help. I meant, Lord, help my unbelief because I don't understand. But he spoke it. I believe what he said. Amen. If it in me, it's in me. Amen. I ain't denying it, girl. I ain't denying it. Now, and see, I'm going to open this set up to y'all so the enemy can't work. You to them. Amen. Amen. See, that's what I'm saying. When you open and say it, get with somebody you can say it to, and then you know, hey. Mm -hmm. you, know, you know, I was talking to you about the spirit of hurt. Uh 
uh -huh. that I had to face. Uh -huh. You know, and and now it's like <laughs> once you face it, Amen. see that what you got to do. The open, do the open, expose the enemy. Amen. See, that's why you know the enemy has so much on because we don't open expose it. Right. So if I don't open expose it out of my mouth, mm -hmm. then every night here. Mm -hmm. But see, when he come, he said, oh, "You can't use that against me." I don't know. I don't, I don't realize that. Mm -hmm. So that's what we need to do. You know. Oh, but that's why Jesus, when he come at Jesus, Jesus said, you can't tempt me. Mm -hmm. He came at Jesus so many ways, but Jesus can't have a word to say there. Mm -hmm. Amen. Look what else he said. For he shall not speak of himself. See, he ain't going to speak of him. Mm. But whatsoever he shall hear. He ain't going to speak nothing that he ain't heard. Mm -hmm. That shall he speak. And he will show you things to come. He will guide you and show you. Yes, wow. He will guide you and show you. Guide you and show you. Thank you. That's how Jesus was so sincere. His father was guiding you and showing you. And you just think. That's what he want to do with us. Mm -hmm. If we face the truth. the truth and let the truth of God increase our soul. Yes, That's where your prosperity comes through to truth. Yes. Hallelujah. You increase in truth, you got it made. Hallelujah. Now we're going to go back over to 1 John. Let me show you some more. We're going back to 1 John. First chapter, go back to 4, four and 6. Don't get lost on them there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Let John. Uh, first John, first four, first John, first chapter, four, four and six. Look what he said. Ye are of God. First John. First John. Four. Chapter one, right? Yeah. Four and six. Uh -huh. And these things. <laughs> <laughs> She'll love us again, y'all. I mean, that's it. Mine for the one. I gotta get that paper. <laughs> <laughs> she left me. I was with her. Oh, no. <laughs> you and he's growing in you, 
That means the flesh is dying and you ain't no more walking in the and no darkness, and that means you are not in that place of a sin nature. You want all about that sin. And when you didn't have it, you would all make do what you want to do. Amen. But now you have the truth in you, you just don't all just sin. Amen. You don't have that urge to just sin. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. And so in him is no darkness at all. Verse 6, I'm going to get to if we say that we have fellowship with him and walk in darkness, we lie. All right. That's not, not the truth. Oh. So now you can tell the difference. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If we say that we have fellowship with him and walk in darkness, we lie. We lie. So who we lie to? Ourselves. We lie to ourselves. So I'm not fully, what I was saying a while ago, I hadn't fully allowed him to have full control in me like he should. So I'll be what? Lying to myself. So I still got some places that he need to cover. Amen. 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 I still got some dark spots in me. Amen. Amen. I need to drink me a little bit of help me too. <laughs> Going down. That's why we need to allow the word. The pierce in the heart, not let it sit up on a lot of people quote scripture and say all these scripture, but he have them pierce the heart. The word have to pierce the heart before you change. Amen. If you don't change, if the word don't pierce the heart, you will not change. You will quote scripture all the time and still. And you still walking in darkness. Amen. The word have to pierce. I thank God. I, yes. He pierced my heart. Amen. So I he can quote. I'm telling you, just like he just bring a scripture up and I meditate on it, you know, and begin to get in there and see what you're talking about. Amen. So he's piercing my heart. I mean he's getting deeper inside. That's why it's a deeper depth, deeper and deeper. Yeah. The more deep he is, the more he rooted in you. So you no more in you, you more him and less Amen. of you. Amen. 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 Thank God, I want to die. Thank yes. God. Die to myself. Yes. So he tell you, God, we lie and do not the truth. You can't do the truth. <laughs> if you lie, that's true. You can't do it. Come on. And, and then too, when we when we when we don't do the truth. We really dying, destructing ourselves mm -hmm. because we're not facing the truth. Right. So we're we're constantly walking in darkness and constantly uh, uh, being in bondage because we won't face and deal with the truth. Right. If you got if lust in you, in you lust or if you got whatever, whatever in you, you ain't no come. Be true, and then God can change that. Mm -hmm. And see, that's what I'm saying. He said, I came to fulfill the law. Mm -hmm. Only God can change it. Because we have to love people for who they are. Mm -hmm. Until God changed them, they are who they are. Mm -hmm. And long as you know who you are, until God change you, don't feel condemnation because Jesus covered you by the blood. Mm -hmm. Long as you believe in Jesus, you come into Jesus. Jesus won't bring the changes. You mm -hmm. cannot change yourself. Mm -hmm. Only by the change is Him. Mm -hmm. And you have to come to Him to, for Him to change you. Mm -hmm. You just don't come one day and don't seek Him, don't pray, don't reach a word. You will not change. Because mm -hmm. the word will change. If you don't know the word, it can't change you. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. And when, it, when that's when it, that key hit. Because it's in you. Jesus is in you. You are breathing the breath of life every day. Only thing different. Only thing different is you just hadn't hit the right key to stir him up inside you so he can come real alive that you realize he's there and not in you. That's it. You may wake up in the morning, he wake you up. Wait, I'm going to breathe in my breath in him. I love her enough till she realize I'm the one. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Mm -hmm. Thank you. People don't know how blessed we are. We don't know how blessed we are. Mm -hmm. 
The breath of life. How, you know, you think about how many years that we've been robbed. Yeah. Didn't even know. Sometimes we don't know what kind of good thing we got, Lee. You really don't. Jesus is really good, though. Yes, he is. Mm. See, read that, read verse 7. Go on down there. I didn't put it down, but read that. Look what it says. But if we walk in the light, as he is in the light. As he is in the light. We have fellowship one with another. Why well, will say look at fellowship Jesus and Jesus. Mm -hmm. We fellowship. Amen. And the blood of Jesus Christ, his son, cleanseth us from all sin. Oh, you clean. Continually. Oh, continue cleaning you. Yeah. You're clean. When you face the truth of the word, it cleans you. That's why you you don't feel the way you used to feel. All the way you ain't clean, cause you hold to what the the past. Oh. People hold on too much past stuff, oh. past hurt, past this, past that. And more you hold on to past stuff, that means the enemy grips you. He said, old things have and behold them. See, I ain't gonna hold to the past. I, if I talk about my past, then I, it grip me. It's gone. Jesus done clipped me from that. My past hurt. My this, this, uh, my enemy. I, don't, I ain't got name. and then he purifies you with the word. Yeah. The word is to purify. Amen. 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 That's good, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You go ahead. <laughs> 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 you know what I, what bag you are. Mm -hmm. You bag. Yeah, Amen. Amen. You so valued that that the enemy tremble when you walk down the road. Amen. When you and see, that's why you you have to realize you have who you are, what you are. When you walk on the job, when you yeah. go places, you have to realize it's the baggage that you have so inside of you that people image is jealous of it, and they have the wrong type of spirit, so they try to attack the Jesus in you. It ain't you they attack, they attack into Jesus in you. Trying to kill, kill who you are. Amen. Okay, we're going to go back to 1 John again, but I got to get 1 Corinthians 2 and 14. Just flip over there, and then we're going to go back to 1 John. And I'm going to end it out. Uh-huh, 1 Corinthians. 2nd <laughs> chapter. 14 verse. Verse 14. And he's going to talk to you about it. But the natural man receiveth not the things of the Spirit of God. See, now I just got through saying that then. The natural man ain't going to receive. See? The natural man, that means the flesh.